Hi, I am Dr. Mohan Athanari, Biological Science Data Analyzer, Statistics Bio 7. Welcome to our channel. Today we will discuss topic how to draw a grouped double y axis. The bar graph with standard deviation in graphite pair sum software. This is the data set for the double y axis bar graph with standard deviation. First one for the we take the five samples and the group for the two group first one for the ph second one for the terminity okay the, the group for one each group for three time replication in five samples okay the select the whole the samples and right click and copy the data go to the crop it pearson software and the created options for xy and the data table the selected for the first one options in the enter or import data into the new table the next one options for the XHS is a number selected. Then third one options Y use for the and second one options enter the three time replication value in side by side sub columns. Okay, if you want the replication times in the uh, data analysis many times in the our samples the four times and five times or six times use the up the arrow button you replace in time the increase. Okay, I choose the three time replications okay they enter the replication value in the three so then created for the click the created button then data column open for the graphite pearson software okay select the access title column and the right click use the mouse paste the data okay our data is paste now the created for the double y axis power graph okay the choose the options for the created a new graph of the exciting data Click this buttons the open the new tab for the graphite PSM in the creating new group. Okay, the table for the data sheet is the one. Okay, the kind of the graph so click the so menu, click the this button, the many of the graph group opening. Okay, I choose for the group column. Okay, the next one for I choose the summary data and the use for the first one the summary data in the group uh, bar graph. Select this one options and the plot for the mean with the standard deviations okay then click the ok button the created for the graph in the grayscale method in the graph wide pearson software now the customizer for the this graph okay now the increase the graph size okay okay now the increased okay the, then click for the terminate the bar graph right click and the click the format graph the menu then open for the new tab the format of the graph okay the data set for the two types that we take the data set the first one for the ph and uh, data set for the b is a terminity okay the first change uh, customized for the terminity data set okay the additional the options for the your right axis in this choose the right y axis okay then click the apply button Okay, now the created for the double Y axis in the crop it pair some software. The first one the left side axis for the pH and right side Y axis for the terminity. Okay, now the change the bar color. The use options for the bar and the box. Select the button and change the color. And the border size change to the one. And the border color is black. Then click the apply button. Okay, now the change the terminity color. Okay, the next is uh, change for the bar color in the pH data. Change to the data set in the pH, change it. Then click the bar options in the box, the fill the color click. Change to the bar color. And the bar border, the one. Then bar color is a uh, water color is a black. Then click the apply button. Okay, the change the bar color in the terminity and the pH value. Okay, then uh, next one option for the add the value for the, our bar graph. Use these options and go to the many uh, three options for the, the data enter in the, our bar graph. The first one for the above bar and the error bar, then within bar the top and the within bar in the bottom. Okay, these options used the uh, within bar in the bottom. The show options for the plotted value mean and medium value select these options. Then the for Dimensional value for the click the two times. Okay, then click the apply. The data value is entered. Okay, now the customizer for the data value in the font. Then uh, unclick for the automatic dimensional font. Then open the view on the font menu. Then click the button. 
the open the new tab for the fund options use the many fund in the available in the systems okay i choose the time roman fund time roman and regular size is a 12 uh, change to the 10 okay then i click apply then click the apply button okay the change with the bold click the bold options okay the bold okay this is the bold okay the font color change to the use this options in the auto then select the color use the white color then apply the whole the color white or the choose the black change color is a black bold okay next one for the change in the sample the sample the font and the y axis font uh, change to the font time roman and 14 and the sample time roman click the font size is 14 okay the 14 samples okay the next one for the use for the right y axis the data this is for the turbinity enter the name for the turbinity okay the turbinity use the time roman or 14 then this is options for the y axis in the left the ph use options for the ph okay this value data deleted okay now the change the use the select the group and the ph and turbinity they click the control button and select the two options and move to the mouse okay the center options the ph and the turbinity okay the, if you want to change for the value in the y axis the value the right y axis and left y axis select the y axis in the double key your mouse open the new tab for the format of the x axis now the select for the right click y axis if you want uh, automatically the select the automatically unclick for the automatically button the minimum range and uh, minimum range and maximum ranges choose for the terminate value okay this is for the terminate value 0 to 600 i choose the terminate value 300 to 600 then apply okay this is for the terminate value is a 300 to uh, 600 value okay they mentioned balance zero okay this is a uh, customized for the value in the minimum and maximum value for the uh, right axis the same options used for the the left axis in the ph value okay the ph value minimum uh, 0 to the 10 if you click the on click for the automatic checkbox ph value minimum 5 to the 10 then apply okay this is for the ph value minimum to the 5 to 10 okay then choose the 0 to 10 then click uh, apply button okay this is for the customized in the axis okay the font change to the right to uh, uh, axis 14 then same option selected for the left to axis time roman font and 14 okay the same change font okay this is for the created method for the grouped double y axis bar graph with standard deviation in the graphite psm software if you any doubt any doubt in the this video leave me comments in the comment box i will help you thank you for watching this video